imagine, guys, think what what. When you started the, the semester uh, in autumn, were you imagining that eight months later you will be in Los Angeles for a, an international competition when we are in the final 20, best in the world, over 5,000? Il faut comprendre que dans la réalité des études qu'ils ont à l'EPFL, certains étudiants sont encore en train de passer un examen aujourd'hui à l'EPFL et puis ils vont prendre le vol demain, puis après-demain seront ici avec nous. Donc hier, concrètement, il y avait des, des tensions dans l'équipe, mais comme ça arrive dans n'importe quelle équipe de sport ou même n'importe quelle entreprise, et que là, il y avait besoin de, de se mettre au clair. Et ce que j'ai trouvé génial hier, c'est que dans la discussion, les choses étaient claires. Et on est là tous pour le même but avec en plus le rappel que euh, je crois que nous sommes deux dans ce cas-là, nous faisons partie des deux équipes qui venons pour la première fois. Toutes les autres équipes sont déjà habituées, ont déjà fait les, au moins une ou voire deux des, des précédentes éditions. Et pour ça, nous, ben, on doit aussi apprendre plein de choses de comment ça se passe dans la compétition. Donc hier, les, les choses euh, ont, ont pu être bien mises à plat et franchement, j'étais positivement réjoui ce matin. C'est que ce matin, quand on s'est vu après le petit-déj, directement les gens étaient « Ok, c'est clair, on va bosser, on va faire ci, ça ». Ils sont organisés, ils sont allés dans, dans les chambres euh, avec leur ordinateur, prêts à travailler, ils sont mis à travailler d'eux-mêmes. Donc ça c'est couple, et puis ça c'est puissance mécanique, les RPM sont là. Ouais. Uh, I'm done with his team, but not with them. <laughs> we'll do the cleaning with Stefan and uh, Silvan, that yes, also yes, right. Yes, yes, And Fedele, Simone, Ah, it's Mario. Okay. Hi, Mario. Yo. We are with, with all the team. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hey, Mario. Hey. Yo, Mario. Hi, hi, guys. Hi, hi, that is Mario. <laughs> <laughs> hi, yo. Sorry, it's so, uh. It's We are here now in the motel, um, basically waiting for the pod to arrive in a few days. And the challenge mainly now is we, we want to show to SpaceX that our project is a safe one. That um, SpaceX can trust our team to put their pod inside this vacuum tube, which of course is a very expensive one, it's a very big investment for SpaceX, so they do not want to destroy it. So we have, to, we have to prove that, we have to prove that we are safe. So actually the entire team now is working on a, on a safety document, um, showing that we did a lot of tests to, to prove that it is safe. And specifically for the batteries, this is the case. Because the batteries, as you might know, lithium, lithium batteries, when they catch fire, it's a very violent fire. And it's almost impossible to actually uh, put off this fire. So, We had, to, we had to put a lot of safety mechanisms inside the battery to make sure that this does not happen. So any team members that will be handling the batteries will need to undergo training when they arrive. Um, we will organize the high voltage training. So we are subdivided in multiple teams. For example, the mechanical team, um, they will be allowed to work on the brakes, for example, or on the chassis and things like that. But, on the, but they would not be allowed to work on the batteries. That will only be the, the, the six people in total that are working in the battery team. So that is how we subdivided everything. And when you count all those people up, normally everybody should be allowed to work on some aspect of the pot. Uh, because one mistake can really have a very big impact on the, on the voltage and therefore on the speed. Because only a few months ago, they were just drawings on paper and then arriving here in LA, seeing the tube in real life and, and, and it all becomes very real. And now being here, it becomes even more real because it's not only batteries and a pod and just this, 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 this pod that we built, but it also becomes part of this challenge, part of this worldwide challenge that we are trying to, to meet, um, being, being transport in general and trying to make transport for people uh, easier. That's good.